Is this a Rage Against the Machine cover? Nope. Ooh. Wait. Could be. Very well could be. That'd be cool. Nice. Okay. So, Slapshock. We've done a couple Slapshocks in the past. Mm-hmm. Um, can't really remember if we really super liked them. I mean, I think they're good. I, um, we did uh, Agent Orange. That's a good tune. I actually listened to that a couple times. Oh, there. yeah. I remember that one. Mm-hmm. That was good. Um, and I think we did a couple other ones. But we have, I have not done one in a while, and I keep getting this one a lot. This one's always kind of been on the radar for you know, people recommending, so I'm going to finally get to it tonight. Hope you're not pissed that we didn't get to it earlier. Um, what are you doing over there? You're looking up some country stuff, huh? Yeah, we're going to... Country. Yeah, you know, keep the... Uh... Diversity going on the channel here and mix it up a little bit. So this is from the Philippines. They're a rock band from the Philippines. I already knew that. Oh, there's closed captioning. Hmm. <laughs> See, we got English. Auto-generated. This ought to be good. This will be interesting for sure. I <laughs> can <laughs> Sound quality is total horse shit. But other than that, the song's pretty cool. How come they got this in the Philippines and we got stuck with Limp Biscuit here in the U.S.? I don't know. Damn it, we got we, robbed. We got the Limp Bisquick. <laughs> we got the limp end of the stick. <laughs> yeah, these dudes are uh, high energy. Aggressive. Uh, aggressive. Uh, very well played. Similar style to like a Limp Bisquick. But like, they have like a different sound. They didn't sound like they're tougher. Yeah. Like, these, if these guys met... Like, rewind the clocks back to, like, 1998, 1999. If they were to meet in an alleyway, Slapshot would totally beat the hell out of Limp Biscuit in the alleyway. Yeah. They'd, be, they'd like, be laying there. They'd be like, oh! They'd look at Fred Durst go, it's a nice hat. <laughs> they saw men's clothes where you bought it? <laughs> <laughs> This is the part where I talk real slow and try to make a rhyme and flow and drop hot. 
Wake up. Yeah. He's like, wake up. <laughs> Oh. Wait for it. Here it comes. Whoa, check it out. He's singing about that alcoholic drink that all the women drink. Why? <laughs> uh, I give it to him that it, it wasn't it. You didn't call it. You did no, not call I it. I fucked up. No, no. It's because they're an unpredictable. Yeah, they didn't okay. follow the stereotypical formula. Mm -hmm. Everything that you were making your guess based off of, I would have put money down on that. I'd have been like, you can take this. And I'd have been like, where the fuck did you get that? I, I work, man. You know, I got a job. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I'd have been like, there's my bet that you would be right. But sure enough. Good old George Washington. They just didn't follow that formula. And then they had a lot of interesting parts in there doing different stuff with the guitar that, that like, what, you, 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 kind of thing. I don't know. <laughs> oh, you, you should start a band with your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You know who I could picture really singing this? Jonathan Davis. Cantatero Sabano. Oh, yeah. I bet you mm. he would rip this one out. Um, he would do it like, he would might throw his own like little spin on there too, kind of like how Eric, uh, uh, Eric Terrible, Alex Terrible does it. You know, mm -hmm. he would maybe throw in just a little extra aggression. Yeah, that'd be cool. I'd yeah, be down see, to watch that. See, I know, I know that uh, that's his, this is his favorite band. Is it really? Yeah. How's that dude been doing anyways? Mm -hmm. I haven't really seen him around. Um, he hasn't been doing very good, man. Oh, shit. He's had, his daughter got sick, and, um, yeah, she was in the hospital for a while, and it's too bad. It's a good dude. He ended up having to, like, uh, sell his, or pawn his phone and to pay for her medical bills. Now, that's a fucking good dude. When you're, um, you know, having to do that to pay your daughter's medical bills. Yeah. yeah. And he, and knowing how much, much like videos. His live videos and stuff, yeah. I think he's coming back. I saw him with a mic again. Um, so I'm kind of curious to see what he's been put comes out with. Um, he's been doing a couple lives, so he must have got a, a new uh, mic, but his camera looks like he hasn't got his camera back yet upon all that stuff. Sucks. Well, hopefully his daughter's all right. Yeah. So I'll have to, I'll have to message him one of these days, and I'm sure he's going to see this video. So Everybody message this. that dude. Watch him and show him some support. Yeah. Check his channel out. You know, actually, that song has a heavier meaning like a deeper meaning than I thought it did. At first, honestly, I thought they were playing in a kitchen. It's a morgue. It's a morgue. Mm -hmm. Or an operating table. Like, they were giving that dude CPR. Yeah. Wake up. Like, somebody that they know, they lost someone, and they wish they could just have them wake back up. Or. So that's why it was a. Or. The song was about, like, in general, you know, people, violence, stuff like that. And they end up killing themselves, and he's telling them to wake up. I don't know. Someone tell us uh, who's right, who's wrong. Maybe there is no right or wrong. Maybe we're just you yeah. know uh, overthinking it. Possibly. 
I, I bet it. I bet a whole dollar on it. <laughs> Maybe you'd like to reconsider. <laughs> Maybe this will change your mind. <laughs> Turn it over. <laughs> Hey, hey, anyway, uh, thanks for checking us out. Thanks for watching the channel. No, I didn't Pinoy bait by doing Slapshock. That's coming. Uh, every time I do. Uh, yeah, everybody do always says that, but you know from what? from Philippines, they think I'm baiting. Um, not baiting. Uh, just doing recommendations, so chill. I'll be baiting later when I get home, and I... No, never mind. See ya, guys. Thanks very much for watching us, and uh, be sure to check out... <laughs> Cantatero Sabano. I, I never say his first name right. All right, Cantatero. see you guys. Bye.